Hey, this is Will from Lifter LMS. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can install and activate add-ons you purchase from Lifter LMS using the Lifter LMS Helper plugin. So I'm here on my website right now. Um, let's say I just purchased something from the Lifter LMS store that I want to add to my website. What I'm gonna do is log into my account at lifterlms.com, this little icon in the corner there. Let me get my password. So I'm gonna log in. And that will take me to the My Account page here where I can head to Downloads on the side right there. And then I'm going to scroll down to Lifter LMS Helper. I'm going to Download. That's going to add a zip file to my downloads on my computer here. There it goes. So now that downloaded, I'm going to head back to my website. I'm going to head to Plugins, Add New, and then Upload at the top. Then I'll upload that Lifter LMS Helper plugin that it downloaded, then activate. So now that the plugin's activated, I can head to Lifter LMS, add-ons and more, and I'll see this My License Keys button right here at the top. That's where I'll go to my LifterLMS.com account, grab my license key, I'm gonna copy that key, and paste it right into my license key area there. Click Add New and I'm good to go. So now I had an Infinity Bundle license there so I can install and activate any add-ons in my license uh, right from the back end of your website. So now if I wanted to add social learning to my website, I'll just click Install, Apply, and it'll do its thing. It's gonna install the plugin automatically for me. And then social learning, I'm gonna activate Apply. So you install it, then activate it. And now, under the Lifter LMS settings, I'll have options for uh, social learning. So it's as easy as that to install the helper plugin. And then now under add-ons and more, you can install any add-ons you have access to. Plus you'll receive the automatic updates as uh, the Lifter developers release uh, an update for any plugins you have on your site. They'll automatically um, uh, be available for you to update there. Otherwise, you'd have to go to your account, download the newer version of the plugin, and then put it on your website. It's kind of a pain. So this just makes it so you'll see the update right in your dashboard, and you can just click Update Now in your regular updates area.